Hello, everyone. Welcome to the first in a new series of tech spotlights that we're doing here at Fora. Hi, I'm Jake. I'm one of our three co-founders. And so I'm the only one that doesn't have a travel background, but I have a deep technology background and I come from previous startup and consulting in the past where I've built a lot of product and technology to create value. And what's exciting for me about this is this project is the opportunity to do something a little bit different and new in the travel space uh, for travel advisors and tackle some of the challenges that this industry faces and modernize some of the tooling that we're building for our community of advisors in a slightly different way than what's been done in the past. All right, the live demo. So some of you who've been following Fora um, and seen our announcements may have seen some of this before, but this is our portal um, that all advisors Fora get access to. It's sort of your home. Every advisor gets an email that's a at fora.travel email that allows you to log in to this portal and sort of is the hub of your uh, interface to Fora and the advisor community. We've been around for almost three years, but just maybe like two and a half, two and three quarters of years. The portal has only been around for half that time. So we operated at the beginning without a portal, doing everything a bit more manually. And we launched this in the summer of 2022, which seems like a long time ago now. And just this past fall, we had a very big announcement with the launch of our booking platform, which I'll show you in a little bit. And we have a whole team of people, about half the company here at Fora works on, on this particular product every day, launching new things and making it better for our advisors. The philosophy here is to allow advisors to come to one place and have all of the tools that they need at their fingertips to make their job as easy as possible to book travel and serve their clients. So here you can see in the bookings tab, all of the bookings that you've made for your clients in the past from travel, from hotels to cruises, um, to everything that we can book, insurance. There's a CRM where you can view your clients. What's really neat about the CRM is that we have an integrated secure credit card functionality where you can actually store credit cards securely. So you can actually send your clients a link. If I want to collect a credit card from a client, I can generate this link. I can copy the link. I can send it to my client, I actually go and enter their credit card details, their name and address. And then that credit card which goes up directly here in your portal under the client for you to use. And we'll talk, we'll, I'll show you a little bit later how easy it is to use this card now to actually make a booking for your client. You can also reveal the details, which I won't do at this moment because this is actually the real credit card that we're going to use to make a booking, but you can reveal the, the credit card and actually copy and paste it if you need to make a booking that way. We have a whole bunch of marketing tools. This section is something that we're working on expanding a lot during the upcoming year. So we're going to build an integrated email marketing platform, have some link out to for a sponsored website builder, provide you with social media templates that you can post directly into your social media and sort of do a lot more around the intersection of your clients and your trip activities, the content that we produce at Fora with easy to use marketing tooling for you to drive travel demand. We have an extensive training library that covers three main topics, the business of being a travel advisor and how to do it, what skills you need, how to make a booking, how to get started, what you need to know. Our certification tracks are in here. So we have multiple levels of certification that you go through to become certified, advanced, and a pro advisor. All of that training is here. We also have, I'm sure we're at over a hundred different modules of partner training. So we invite our partners from whether it's cruise partners, hotel partners, DMC and tour operators to come and visit us virtually. We record these sessions, and make them available for all of our advisors to do replay at a later date. And we'll talk a little bit about how we've used AI to create transcripts of these sessions and then allow advisors to search these sessions. We also have an extensive library of destination trainings. So these are usually hosted by either Henley, our sort of travel agent number one co-founder, who is a veteran travel advisor or someone else from HQ or our community who has specific knowledge of a specific location. So if you wanted to learn about, let's say, I think it's all the way at the bottom here, the wine regions of France. This one actually I hosted last summer while I was in France. Part of my family is there. So I hosted a session on specifically around tourism for wine in France, but we have almost every region of the world covered and you can replay these at any time. You can link up to your email. There's a community portal where we have all of our advisors actively posting and contributing to ideas. And we'll talk about how you can search that using our new AI sidekick in a little bit. You can also get help. So we have a lot of resources available for our advisors, plus easy access to our support team. So we have a support team that's monitoring support questions, not quite 24 hours a day, but 
pretty close to it. So I'll jump right into our booking platform. This is maybe so far the most exciting part of what we're doing. So we have almost 30,000 hotels that you can book all over the world in our portal. Uh, this number is going up regularly. You can also see that we have just over 5,000 um, hotels with perks. So what does this mean? They're either part of our own Fora membership program where we have our own negotiated perks or they're part of a consortia like Virtuoso or they're part of a hotel's own program. Let's, we'll see this in a minute. So the example that I like to use is always Paris. Um, I'm going to search for short stay there. It's pretty quick. I can see all of Paris. So the Kimpton Saint Honoré is our actually top booked hotel in Paris. So these are the correct dates. I can see the rooms that are available. I'm going to pick this room. I'm going to look quickly at the rate details. This is part of IHG's luxury and lifestyle partnership. So I have perks available to me. I can actually confirm that the rate is correct. I can scroll down. I can go to checkout. I can pick my client. The credit card that I previously got from my client is right here. An IHG loyalty program would be here and I can book. It's actually that simple. And this works on mobile phones as well. So your clients, you can book for your clients wherever you are on the road, tablets or your computer. It's pretty simple. Now, if I wanna go back and actually cancel that booking, I can go here and cancel it. Done, you can hear all the details. This past August, we spun up a new product and engineering pod here at Fora that's specifically working on integrating AI into our advisor toolkit. We get a lot of questions about AI and the future of travel advisors. Like why are you building a human-centered travel business in the age of, of AI? And I think that hospitality in our view is really centered around humans. Humans drive hotels and cruises. Humans are the actual people providing hospitality on site. Humans are the people that are actually traveling. In our view, it makes sense to have humans as a part of the travel booking process. That doesn't mean that there isn't space for AI. And we sort of sort of see AI as the magical toolkit that will enable the humans involved in all these processes to make them better at it. And so the first thing that we've launched is the Psychic, available to all advisors here, right in Portal. Psychic has in its knowledge, it's based on GPT-4 from, from OpenAI, but it's been trained with all of the information that we know here at Fora. So it's been trained on all of the posts in our community. We have thousands and thousands of posts in our community forum. We have hours and hours of training content. We have all of the guides and information on our website. We have all of the information available in our booking platform, including hotel descriptions, perks, commission rates, things like that. And you can ask it questions. So how do I VIP my client? This is maybe a newer advisor question thinking about, okay, my client is going to a hotel. What should I do? We have a whole training on this and we have other resources that you can access. You can ask it, is there advantage to booking with preferred partners? This is a more general question and it will take you to the resources we have on this. You can ask it very specific questions like, I would like it to a family friendly itinerary to Paris. And I even made a typo here and it pops up a whole bunch of information around family friendly say that five times fast, family-friendly itineraries to Paris, including links to resources that we have in our community from other guides that advisors have written on our website to forum posts about this specific topic. We often get this, why is it better to book with a four advisor than let's say book with Amex where I can also get perks and we have really good answers for this and we have a lot of advisor commentary on these topics and so you can ask it things like this that will help you uh, to the information that you need that might be buried throughout our community. And here, I'm going to do something live now. So let's say I wanted to know who are our preferred partners in Dublin. So here you see an answer where it did list some of our preferred partners in Dublin, and then also gives you a link to go to the booking platform where you can search um, directly and find more of our preferred partners. You can also ask it other questions like what Greek islands can be easily combined together. Um, so this is a topic that comes up frequently, and it links to some of the forum posts on this topic, including some of the training that we have as well. This is just the very first version um, that we released for our advisor public. Behind the scenes, we have other projects that we're working on to link this to our actual booking platform to be able to pull rates and to do much more complex work, such as automatically generating emails for you to reply to clients, automatically generating the VIP emails that you send to hotels, and other kinds of tools that allow you to work faster and smarter as an advisor. Finally, just a small little thing that I'll showcase. Uh, so the real thing that will come in the next 
installment of the series will be the maps that we're going to launch um, in the booking platform. And I'm very excited to show you that. In the meantime, and to start preparing for that, we actually made our booking platform smarter so that it knows neighborhoods. So our office here in New York is in Tribeca, where we're surrounded by some fantastic hotels. So I just searched Tribeca. And while you don't see Tribeca in this address data here, what we've done is actually used AI to identify the neighborhood of every hotel that we have on the platform. And you can search by neighborhoods and it will show you the hotels in those neighborhoods, including the very brand new Warren Street Hotel that just opened from one of our partners, Firmdale, which has definitely left a very new colorful mark on the neighborhood. That is the end of our official demo. Thank you so much for joining. It was a pleasure to have you here today.